हेलो स्टूडेंट्स वेलकम टू चैनल लर्निंग एंड रीडिंग वर्ल्ड टुडे वी आर डूइंग क्लास सेवेंथ मैथ्स चैप्टर दैट इज इंटीजर्स चैप्टर वन ओके सो लेट्स स्टार्ट चैप्टर वी आर डूइंग इंटीजर्स I hope you all have done in class six. What are integers? First, I will explain you this in a whiteboard. Okay, just wait. I hope you all can see this whiteboard, right? Okay. So I was talking about integers. What are? Wait. Let me write in more small. writing okay yeah so what are integers see we have so many types of numbers right means we have infinite right numbers are infinite Mean it can start from zero, one, then two, three, four, and then this continue so on and so on. We cannot end this counting. It will go to thousand. It will go to hundred. It will go to lakh. It will go to crore. Then it becomes a chain, right? In easy way, also it becomes a chain, right? Okay. Now, tell me. See, we have integers. We are doing integers. Integers means. See, we have one, two, three, four, right? Then this is continued, infinite. Okay. so these number can be in negative form in kya ke koi sign nahi hai means ye in kya ke means ye positive hai right agar main in kya ke ek minus ka sign laga do kya laga do ek minus ka sign theek hai एंड देन में नंबर लिखूँ तो मैंने माइनस लगाया देन नंबर लिखा देन माइनस लगा के देन नंबर लग गया तो इससे क्या हो जाएगा ये नंबर नेगेटिव बन जाएगा मीन्स इंटीजा इंटीजा मीन्स अ नंबर लाइन अ नंबर लाइन राइट विच इन बिटवीन वी हैव जीरो ओके एंड ऑन दिस इज राइट साइड राइट दिस इज राइट एंड दिस इज लेफ्ट सी इन ईजी वे इफ यू डोंट नो राइट लेफ्ट सो यू कैन लर्न दैट वेन योर डैट ड्राइव द कार सो ही सिट्स ऑन right side and mother always sits on left side this way you can learn the thing he this is your father and she is your mother right clear this way you can learn right and left side so now i was talking about numbers So on right side we have positive numbers. We have positive, and on left side we have negative. Clear? This will be minus one, minus two, minus three. Then one. Sorry. Wait. Then two, and then three. This becomes a positive and negative. Now, how we represent all these numbers on number line? So, for that, you need to make a straight line in between, right? 
then in between you will make this and here will be zero here you will write one then leave two or three gaps one two I'm doing one, two, three, four, five, and on six one I will make one. Take okay. care. Then again one, two, three, four, five, six, and then let me draw it in small. Okay. This is your line. This is your zero. So one. Two, three, four, five. Sixth will be your number. Again, one, two, three, four, five. Sixth will be your number. Same goes again and again. You can continue. Now, same. One, two, three, four, five. Six will be minus one. Then, one, two, three, four, five. Six will be minus two. This is how we make a number line. Is this clear to you all? Is this clear to you all? Okay. Now let me go to the chapter. So now we are doing integers, right? This is our heading. It is very easy chapter if you learn carefully. Okay. I just taught you about the number line. Right. So. This chapter. Introduction. We have learned about whole numbers and integers in class 6. We know that integers form a bigger collection of numbers which contain whole number which contain whole number, negative number. Okay. What other reference do you find between whole number and integers? In this chapter, we will study more about integers, their properties and operations. First of all, we will review and revise what we have done about integers in our previous class. So recall, we know how to represent integers on a number line. Some integers are mar marked number line on the number line given below. See, as I told you, as I told you that we make a number line right this is called number number line right so this becomes our zero this is our right side means positive or we can make the plus sign this is our negative that is left side right now so i think this much you all know how to represent a number till class 7 it's very easy you will get a number and you just have to write down the number on number line and then you can mark it like this right like this like this but when you go to higher classes it will be like mark um one upon two or minus one upon two or you can get some three upon four right it will be in fractions so this is your basic learn properly revise it properly right now next we have done addition and subtraction of integers in our previous class with the following statements On the number line, we add positive integers, we move to right. Add negative numbers, we move to left. As I told you, that positive numbers 
are represented on are represented on right side negative numbers on left side then subtract a positive number we will do on left side and subtract a ne negative number we will do on right so this is like some important thing to do which you need to learn right state whether the following statement are correct or incorrect correct those which are wrong when two positive integers are added we get positive we get a positive integers you have to say right or wrong this is exercise going on no i think this chapter is something lengthy yeah so add a positive uh, yeah we are doing state whether the following statement are correct or incorrect correct those which are wrong only so tell me when we add two positive integers we get a positive integers for example um, what i can take if i take 3 this plus 3 right then i'll take so is can so obviously plus me yoga minus me yoga plus plus well, let me tell you some rules right wait okay so see there are some important rules we shall say right of integers only this will help you throughout your future so we get positive integers yes true when two negative integers are added we get positive integers yes when a positive integer and a negative means plus minus are added we always get a negative integer yes additive inverse of an 8 is so minus 8 will be i hope you know what is additive in in additive inverse you all should see well, what is additive inverse when a number is in a plus means it is plus 3 it will become minus 3 if a number is minus 4 it will become 4 we do not need to show plus sign okay don't show plus sign if there is no sign in front of a number if there is no sign in front of a number means so positive hai means plus mein hai theek hai so koi zarurat nahi hoti hai plus sign dikhane ki theek hai ab agar main minus 5 ka additive inverse bolungi to answer hoga 5 10 ka answer puchungi to hoga minus 10 so this is called Additive inverse. Clear? Now, next. For subtraction, we add the additive inverse of an the integer that is being subtracted to the other. For subtraction, we add the additive additive inverse of the integer. Means obviously the comic minus co minus additive in integer ko convert karenge additive inverse ko to obviously plus bhi aayega positive hi to aayega now i'll tell you how to solve all these things it's a, it is in form of lhs equals to rhs our number is minus 10 plus 3 equals to 10 minus 3 so 
page let me go to white page only cause let me tell you first easy thing and i am not doing those sums minus 10 and plus 3 will be just tell me the simple answer minus plus if i am giving you a sum which is like 10 let me see if i give you a sum as 10 plus minus 7 just solve this and give me the answer for this so very easy question if you know and remember the rules so plus minus will be minus so 10 minus 7 will be 3 right and हम sign हमारे पास यहाँ पे दो हैं एक plus एक minus हम sign बड़े digit का लगाते हैं तो यहाँ पे बड़ा digit कौन सा है ten है या seven है ten और ten क्या है positive तो it means answer is three तो positive हम sign show नहीं करते okay now if I give you minus ten wait if I give you minus ten and plus 7 then okay let me change the number this is minus 10 plus 3 then minus into plus will be minus so this answer is minus 1 10 minus 3 will be 7. But sign con saga 10 ka kyuki 10 or 3 may bada digit con sa 10. So answer is minus 7. This is our solution. Clear? Easy? So I hope now you can understand and do these sums yourself. So today I'll give some extra question like this only of additive inverse and of this integers both right in description box please do it and just write yes in comment section if you have done my homework today's and yesterday's i gave you to class 6 Class 6, do you remember class uh, science work which I will give you? And I told you to write yes in the comment section. I checked, nobody has written. Right? So today I want everybody to write yes in comment section. And complete all my work. Okay? Now, see in book also it's given. The additive in words wait if the number is in plus then its answer will be in mean additive in words will be see my it is 10 becomes minus 10 minus 10 from 10 76 minus 76 minus 76 plus 76 so this minus plus minus plus clear and it is very important so the thing which I thought is important I am making a star okay try to do some yourself edit inverse of any number a is minus a and additive inverse of minus a is a correct subtraction okay hmm was giving compare or answer with the answer given below i want you to do this part yourself so this is your homework homework this is one See, you know, see, aage correct or incorrect likha hai. Aap ek baar try karoge. Okay, then three. Okay. 
then this four five सिक्स ठीक है ये जो भी आपको दिख रहा है वो सारा चाहिए यहाँ से लेके राइट टिल हेयर सारे पार्ट्स इसके आई एम मार्किंग इट अगेन सो दैट यू कैन चेक फ्रॉम हेयर टू हेयर check yourself students i know the video has become longer but please don't leave in between and don't skip the video right isme bahut efforts lagte hain video banane mein right it's not easy so and i hope all my students will do work very properly and carefully complete class 6 and class 7 both of you tomorrow we will start the exercise for this chapter basically this was our introduction to this new chapter of class 7 is this clear so now If anybody is having problem in any of my video, can comment me in the comment section below and ask his or her doubt. I will answer your questions as soon as possible. Okay, think as in I'm your real teacher. And basically, this is our pandemic time going on, so you should study hard. Okay children now let's end this meeting bye bye and thank you for watching